Well, Thanksgiving traditionally is a day of spending time with family, feasting, football games, and parades. And according to etiquette expert Grace Lee, Thanksgiving is a day for gratitude, relationships, tradition, and knowing your social graces, which helps create a wonderful time with everyone when they all get together. This is such an important topic, I think, because etiquette to me can really make or break a day, especially Absolutely. on Thanksgiving. Absolutely. You know, you never know what people are going to say. Right, <laughs> right. Wrong family show up. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> so people are doing things in different ways. Some have like to have the formal sit-down dinners. Some like to have a buffet. Yes. And there's different etiquette for both. Absolutely. Well, the host tells the, the guests what to bring for a buffet. Let's go f with the buffet first. And, uh, and well, make sure you come on time. Mm -hmm. You know how that is. And as guests for a buffet, do not pile your food up. Have you seen the people yes. pile up like this? You should be able to see a little bit of white on your plate. Okay, so that everybody else that come afterwards have a, a little bit more. So the first one is just enough, a little bit of everything. And uh, then you can come back for a second. Okay. And what should we do with children? Because I think when, when it's a family gathering, we're kind of like, ah, the kids can take care of themselves. And especially with a buffet, you know, you don't want a small child just thinking they can go up there and get their own plate. Should parents follow their children? Absolutely. Go first? Depending on how small they are, yes. You should pile, and don't pile it up for them. Just give them a little bit. And the parents should do that. And as if you're going to have a buffet, then you're going to be sitting down somewhere. Usually you don't have a table sometimes. Mm -hmm. So if you have a plate, make sure you're sitting or you're staying still. You're not walking around eating. Okay. That's a no-no, even, even when it's not Thanksgiving. Eating and <laughs> talking. Eating and talking and mm -hmm. walking around with your plate. Okay, so and if you have a, a rowdy child, um, we can put him in the closet. No, no. <laughs> right. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that sounds good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and what's the difference? So then, when you have a formal setting, how how does the etiquette vary? It definitely, d completely different. If it's a formal setting, you definitely have your table mm -hmm. right set beautifully. People are going to oh, fantastic. You have it on the so uh, you should know your table setting. Mm. I left. We did this once. Already. Yes, we did. Yes, we did. <laughs> left. Fork, you know, on the uh, left side, and a knife on the right hand side. So that's basically a, a nice setting that you you can probably get on your uh, your channel, later, right? Right. Okay. So everybody should have a table setting. And um, uh, what else is what else do, should we talk about on the table setting? Let well, me I have a question. If you are going to be the one that's hosting now, that table setting, as beautiful as it was, was very overwhelming, and I probably don't have all of that stuff. I mean, what on there could you possibly eliminate, especially if you're having 12, you know, 13 people at the same table? Ah, okay. So what are the most important the, elements of that setting? The table setting is set but with your menu. If you have soup, you have to have a soup spoon. Okay. If you're having a appetizer and a salad, you have to have an appetizer and salad fork. Right? Okay. And then your dining uh, fork. Okay. So if you're not having any of those, then you don't need them. Perfect. <laughs> so if you eliminate them. Yeah, if you're gotcha. only having a, a, a dining uh, fork, that's, you know, that's all you need. Okay. <laughs> you don't need all that stuff. Okay. So go by your menu. Okay. Right? Okay. Okay. And the, so this is how it works and you have a formal dining, that you're all having uh, cocktails and, and before the dinner, and, the, and your host, when she's ready to uh, serve the dinner, she will ring the bell. Oh, okay. Right? That means that, or whatever she wants to do, right. and, and uh, you sit down, right? You, you, that, that's when you have to sit down. That's when you take your table uh, uh, napkin and put it on your plate, um, okay. on your, on your um, nap, lap. Okay. And then what about, when do we start eating? Say it's a formal setting mm -hmm. and everyone, uh, you know, the food, I know we need to talk about how to pass the bowls, yes. but when do we, do we wait until the final person at the table has food before we start eating? Well, it depends. Now, if you have six people, more than six, this is the rules, more than six, then you can just start eating as soon as your, your, your okay. plate is um, in front of you. But in, in this case, the hostess is the one that lets you know when she's ready to eat, when you're all ready to eat. All the food will be served, and then the hostess will start eating. That's when everybody starts eating. 
Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. But if you have in a regular session or regular dinner, six people or more, then you can just start eating because your food is going to get cold. Right. right. Yeah. But usually everybody gets served in the uh, Thanksgiving. You know, everybody just, okay. So Should we talk about yeah. passing? I mean, yeah. I thought Amanda did a splendid job during the ice cream segment. <laughs> uh, <laughs> passing to the left. <laughs> It's counterclockwise when you when you pass your bowls. Oh, okay. Okay. But if somebody makes a mistake and they do it uh, clockwise, don't worry about it. Not a big deal. Okay. It's counterclockwise. It's counterclockwise. I always thought it was clockwise. That's good. Yeah, I guess I. I've always passed to the left. Mm. It doesn't even matter. Wow. But, but the most important thing is that once it starts, everybody start doing it this way. Don't serve the other way, <laughs> or you're gonna have plates. Clashing. Right, right. So that's the most important. Those are rules that are not that important to remember. As long as everybody's on the same page. Yes. Now, one Quickly. more thing. Okay. Okay. Quickly. Okay. How do you pass? You pass it with the with the, you know with the uh, handle facing the person, Excellent. so that when they when yes when you grab it you Excellent. go ahead and pass it to her. Excellent. Exactly. Grace Lee. Yeah. Thank you so much. You're We're going to direct people to your website. Thank you and happy Turkey Day. Yes. Thank All you right. Thank you me. can learn more on Grace Lee's website, website graceleeinternational.com. And right now you can get a free download of the Fearless Table. Again, that's graceleeinternational.com. We'll be right back.